this cat has been visiting the house every day. Here it is. Whoa. Dude, how do you... Freaking cat. Yo! So there's a house. The beach house. And by far the best thing about this house is... Obviously the pool. Having a pool almost takes away all of your problems. We're just having fun. You feel like a little kid having fun with water and you know. One of these little boogies where you go surfing. Well, not surfing, but boogieing into the beach. And you feel like a kid. You, you know, you play with water. You, you can even build sand castle if you want to. And all of the problems go, go away. You're just floating in a boogie in a pool. <sighs> Fuck. No. Damn it. But in a serious tone, this is indeed a nice house. Ugh. You get out of the pool and then you get inside, which. I probably shouldn't do it since I'm wet. I'm quite wet. But the city is beauty. See that TV? You have AC, which may be the best thing you may have in summer. You have a giant TV. This is ginormous. This is huge. Like, this is way too big, dude. You have some great, you know, some great audio quality watch my YouTube videos or the Netflix series Suits. I don't know, you can watch Suits here, the highest of the definitions. This is the only sofa that has this, which it's not that good. There you go. I would like for this one to have the same thing, like a bed slash sofa doesn't have it, sadly. Even the decorations, they're super smart. First, the plants, they're not real. So they, you know, they're not gonna die since they're like plastic. Because if you put, if you would put like normal plants, they would die in like probably five days or something like that. Because nobody takes care of real plants, let's be honest. And then you get to the kitchen. This kitchen can be the last apartment that I've stayed in. It's huge. It has an oven, but if you're honest, if you're at the beach, you're not gonna cook anything in the oven. You have a huge fridge, but you know, there's nothing in it. It's just an ice cream. That's all there is in the fridge. Oh, the freezer at least. Uh, microwave, important thing. A six, no, it's a five cylinder KitchenAid kitchen. It's a huge kitchen. Like, here you can be cooking, you know, chef things. Like an omelette and bacon and potatoes and bam, bam, bam. Not bad. And after you do all your mess of cooking whatever you were cooking, you have this huge dishwasher with the Secret of America, of course. This is like a really big dishwasher, like a lot of things may fit in here. You can do yourself some toasts. I don't like toasts. I don't know why, but you can do yourself toasts if that's what you want. But what I actually like is this, like this look, the fridge, the oven, and the microwave, the built-in microwave and oven. Ah, oh, man. I wonder how it would be to have one of these in France. That would be really good, really freaking good. Yeah, I can cook, I can make cookies with one of them. I can just invite someone to cook cookies with. That would be good some exotic rocks as well. 
And here's where you eat. So when when you eat, you can be watching something with that amazing TV system. And so just imagine it. I'll show you. I'll, I'll make you, a, you know, quite a glimpse. Oh fuck. So yeah, I'm eating. Whatever I'm eating. Bam, bam, bam. I'm eating my really well cooked omelette with onions and mushrooms and tomatoes. So I'm eating my omelette and I'm watching the news at the same time. Next I'll show you my bedroom, which it's not the best. It's a bit it's a bit messy. Like always. I have my beautiful clothes, Ethan's backpack, my things. And an AC and a broken window, that's no good. I ha I brought my suit because I thought I was gonna do an interview. Turns out I will sadly not do an interview in this wajash, but I have beautiful mirror so you can look at your your beautiful biceps. As well that I haven't occupied yet. Some coats, I don't know why, why would you need some coats when it's 30 Celsius every single day and sunny. Well, probably if you want to put the AC in and cuddle with someone. Uh, there's another bedroom, I will certainly not show it to you because my parents were just probably taking a nap there. And this freaking sofa has to be normal again. But and then when you get out, so you do that, and there you go. Your built-in pool. That's how you can, you have a barbecue as well, so you can just, uh, just do yourself a nice barbecue if you want. That thing, it's probably, it's probably best not using it, since it has a long time of not use. I'm not sure if it would be a good idea using it, but there you go. You have the pool, you can just chill. La pura vida Costa Rica, mi amor. And the pool. And this is this thing. Is if you want to be outside, but it's quite sunny. So you just put this thing on. Aww. You just chill here. Oh my god, you can be here reading a book or watching out while your friends are in the pool but you don't want to get into the pool where it's really sunny and you just put in this magical thing, just chill. And because you're decent, when you come back from the beach and you're, you have sand and all of this, you take yourself a nice shower wash your feet because they're full of sand and then get into the pool because if not what will happen is that the pool will get dirty like that and we don't want it i you know i the pool shouldn't be as dirty as it is but due to my not following of rules the pool is, is quite dirty but it shouldn't be dirty Meow. 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 Meow.